Are you one of those people that really struggle getting their stuff back together? Well, so am I. I usually struggle with putting simple things away and organizing, deep, deep cleaning my room. So in this video, I had enough. And today I am going to be organizing my room, putting my stuff away, cleaning, and doing some things that I have pending, organizing my life, getting everything together so that I can live in peace in my room without having to worry about everything that I have to do. Now, I think we've all seen those videos where YouTubers clean their apartments, clean their rooms, put things away, clean out their closets, and today, that is my goal. I've taken inspiration from a lot of YouTubers that I watch, my main two being Erica Diane's videos where she cleans her room and Sunday reset routines, and Fernanda Ramirez deep cleaning her apartment. Without further ado, let's get started. You can see my bed is kind of a mess. It has a towel in the background. You can also see that I've got a ton of glasses of water in my room. I still have to take to the kitchen. You can't see right now, but I will put footage of how my desk is looking right now because it is kind of a mess. It has literally stuff that I have to put away that I bought recently. And also my bench next to my piano has some stuff that I have to put away as well. And obviously we can't forget my closet that if you open up, you're going to see the horror that is that cave. Because honestly, I have been so busy with extracurricular activities and stuff that I have to do that I have not had the motivation to put anything away. If you don't know, I recently got into a lot of summer courses because right now I'm on my summer vacation and I have been doing art classes, I have been doing pottery classes, which I'd already been doing but I just started doing them again because um, the teacher had to go away for her winter break. And finally, we are um, and I've been also doing crochet classes. I've been uh, going to the gym in the morning, sometimes in the afternoons, and I've been so tired that I honestly haven't had the time, motivation, or energy to um, do what I'm about to do right now. So I, I'm scrolling through YouTube and I saw all these people doing like deep cleaning, closet cleanouts, and putting stuff away, and I got kind of inspired to do it myself because I felt like I was being an unproductive, lazy girl, and that's not what we want for 2024. So right now we're going to be doing that. So right now we're going to be pretty much doing that. I took inspiration from a lot of YouTubers, so I will, I will credit them, and I have some of the videos I took inspiration from screen, and I'm going to be starting right so to get started, we are going to be putting stuff away from over there in the back. We're going to be fixing my nightstand, we are going to be putting the water away, and we are going to be looking at the cabinet that I have over there and seeing what kind of stuff do I want to keep and what do I want to throw away and if there is anything that I don't want anymore and all that kind of stuff so that we can clear out some space and make it look a little bit more organized. So as you can see, this is my nightstand and it's pretty messy. Not only does it have a bunch of glass cups, but inside of this cabinet is a mess. So we are going to be seeing if there is anything that I want to keep or throw away. I don't know what I just found. I have chargers. I have a bunch of chargers here. Um, some of them don't really work, but this one does, so I'm gonna keep this. I'm gonna take pretty much everything away so that I can kind of get a glimpse of what I'm working with and how much space we have in here so that I can just like decide what to throw away, what to keep. Now, I know you can't see me, but it's time for the part that we have all been dreading, which is cleaning up this cabinet. And it's so full of dust that I am honestly dreading it myself. But we are going to push through and we are going to clean this. my 
hair up because of how hot it is in this country but now that this is totally clean and free of dust we are going to be restocking everything and we are going to be putting everything where it belongs Now that the cabinet is finally ready, we're just going to be taking these glasses downstairs and that would be the whole cabinet complete. Next up, we have this desk, which is my vanity and I have been procrastinating cleaning this for quite a while. So we're gonna be doing this right now and I think this is gonna take me the longest time out of everything. This is actually the place that took me the least amount of time and that is kind of surprising because I thought it would take me a while but I was kind of being tricked by the fact that there were so many things and it was like so disorganized that I really couldn't tell. So um, I guess now we can move on to the next part which is cleaning out my closet. So as you guys can see right now, my closet is an absolute mess. So what we're going to be doing right now is hanging up all of these things and taking out everything that I am not going to use anymore and yeah. But we are going to get to the closet clean out now and we're going to be choosing what we are going to get rid of Whether it's for donations or to sell, we're going to check it out So first off, I want to start with something that has been on this closet for quite a while Which is this thing that I have not worn since the downfall of Justice my whole entire room 
and it already feels so much better than before. I feel a lot more free and I feel like I have a lot more space. Anyway, the last final thing that I wanted to do in this vlog was build a Lego set that I have pending and I am going to be doing this because I really want to put a little bit more flowers into my room. And as you can see, I have a whole collection actually over there in the back. I have a whole flower set that is basically the lotus flowers and I think they are so cute. I have the tulip flowers and I have the sunflowers. I still don't have the roses or the wildflower bouquet, but I have the regular flower bouquet that is what we're gonna build right now. This is it and it is such a pretty bouquet. This is so cute. It has lavender, it has, look at these. These are so cute. I have no idea what they are, but they are so cute. And I mean, the whole bouquet itself is so pretty. So right now we're gonna open it and we're gonna build the whole thing. It's been five hours since I last talked to you guys. Yeah, I did spend five hours building this Lego set, but I think it was absolutely worth it. Oh my God, I am so scared of dropping this. Um, and anyway, I ended up putting it in this um, glass vase and I'm gonna leave it here in my vanity so that I can kind of decorate the space a little bit. Yeah, I got so into making the Lego that I totally forgot to have dinner and it's 10 at night. Alexa, encender luces de chole. Mm -hmm. That's better. Anyway, I just wanted to thank you guys for watching this video and I know that I have not been very frequent with my uploads, but I promise I'm working on it. I've been adjusting to so many things and so many activities right now that it's kind of crazy and it kind of gets overwhelming when I have to edit my videos apart from everything that I already have to do. But I promise I am going to start uploading again and I'm going to try and do the best that I can to be as 
frequent as I can and consistent with my uploading schedule. But yeah, that's the end of the video. I hope you guys had a blast watching it as much as I enjoyed making it. If you like this video, consider subscribing and check out the rest of my channel. And I'll see you in the next video.